tensions are flying high in Arlington over a push to extend the runways at Craig Airport. It's an issue residents who live nearby have fought for years. This is Sky 4 video for you of that airport near Atlantic Boulevard and St. John's Bluff. City Council Member Matt Schellenberg is introducing a resolution tonight to look at making the runways longer. He says it'll make the airport safer and boost the economy by bringing in jets. But many neighbors worry that it'll increase the air traffic and the noise around their homes. News for Jack's reporter Vic Michelucci joining us live from City Hall with more on this. Vic? Here's that two page resolution, Joy. It's got some of the details about what he wants to do. Now he's going to introduce it at the City Hall meeting, which started about seven minutes ago here downtown. There are people who say it's a good idea, but we've heard from more who say they disagree. They want the plan grounded. There's a lot of buzz around Craig Airport. Not just from the planes, but the people who live nearby. The noise is irritating, but if a plane crashes, it's a lot more serious and it can kill people. Lad Hawkins speaking to us about yet another push to extend the runways at the Arlington Airport. He's been against expansion for four decades now. We talked with him 12 years ago about the same issue. We were promised that this runway would not be extended. There are two runways here at Craig. They're about 4,000 feet long each, and that is fine for a small propeller plane like this one. But pilots say if you want to attract a business crowd that flies in on jets, you're going to need a longer runway, potentially 5,000 feet. This time around, Jacksonville City Councilman Matt Schellenberg is introducing a resolution encouraging the city and the airport authority to reevaluate the extension of runways. The jets are more efficient, and quite frankly, it will revitalize Arlington. He says a longer strip will cater to business travelers and boost the area's economy. Why is it that a few people and, and Arlington get to dictate what's better, great for Jacksonville. They're holding up progress. Arlington Councilman Al Ferraro disagrees. It was promised to the residents that, that the extension would not happen. So I don't know why they're starting this or who's behind it, but this is not something that I support. And right now, this is just a resolution, so it has a long way that it would have to go before it would become a reality. But some community members say they are going to plan a meeting if it progresses to do everything they can to stop it. We're live at City Hall. I'm Vic Michelucci, Channel 4, The Local Station.